Hey, Tom Downey here. I want to talk about how to check your squish on these little sobs. Get you some solder, okay? You want to get the smallest size solder you can that'll actually squish up with the piston in the head. So I've got three different sizes I use. Once you get your size picked, then go ahead and bend it into a little wishbone. Get it into a wishbone, then I'll take a straight edge and I'll cut off and make them even. You want to use that rather than a, a snipper because the snipper will distort it. So once I get my wishbone made, I do want to make sure you got a 40 thousandths head gasket in there. 40.040 is the number, 40 thousandths. That's a standard head gasket. Once I get it in there, I stick it in a plug hole. You want to go even with the, with the wrist pin. So I always want to check like this. And I got to get my angle set. So I, I come in and hit the sidewall straight. So I do that and I'll just take and I'll roll it up, the piston up. You see the solder lift. Bend the engine over, boom, I got my squish. Probably can't really see it there, but now I'll check it and see what my squish is. This one's got, oh, this one's got about 62,000 squish, which is pretty normal. That's real normal for a little sob. So, and that should diverge. It should be bigger as you go away, as you go up further up the, the solder. But that's all you have to do. It's real simple. You cut about a 30,000 pocket in your head and you're using dome pistons, you should end up with roughly a 60,000 squish. If it's more than that, you're fine. Racing applications, you want to keep it down as close to 50 to 60 as you can, but uh, either way, it'll work fine for you. So, that's all I got. Tom Downey from Fort Dodge signing out.